Last time on Astro Boy Omega Factor, we beat up bosses! Again, we beat up John Spider, we beat up Magnemite, we destroyed the sun and beat the amazing tree, and we kind of did most of that off game screen because we're eventually going through the game again, except there are different circumstances this time because there's a new international council Drake who hates robots and wants to destroy them all and somehow he managed to get in the parliament and uh, he's enforcing the law that one uh, essentially amounts to if any robot as much as snooks the wrong way they will be destroyed not very nice not very nice indeed but um Ah, uh, there's another um, uh, sort of concern Astro is at the moment, and it's essentially who's stalking him? Who's after him? And why is the Zoran's word give me a clue as to who it is anyway? So, who is it exactly? Hey, what? Nuka? What are you doing here? Are you okay? Astro, I came here to say goodbye. I must go someplace very far away. Where are you going? Is, is that red going with you? I, I'm afraid I can't tell you. I can't let you get involved in this. But please, don't forget that I'll always be thinking of you. Even when I'm far, far away. Well, oh, Astro always got these jets. He can just come and visit you every day, can't he? Um... Oh, maybe not. Oh dear. So promise me one thing, Astro. That you'll end this battle between the robots and the humans and bring peace. Me? Well, yeah, you're the hero of the game. Why the hell not? What? How do you know I can do this? I know, because the phoenix told me that you're a very special robot. Cats around, don't she? <laughs> what? Will you stop saying what, what in the... Sorry. Um. <laughs> Will you promise me? You bet! Thank you. And goodbye. Wait, Nuka! Uh, how did you hear the... Phoenix's voice. Astro, this has been an excellent on the moon. Jeez, oh, that was my hiding place. I mean, oh, okay. Fine. Anyways, now we've waved goodbye to Nuka. And suddenly, when she's cleared off, we understand her now. What? Okay, never mind. Doesn't matter because she's in our mega factor, which means. We can upgrade! we still got a few bit of upgrades to do, um, and for this one I think I'll upgrade. I'll go now. Jets. 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 I'll probably upgrade my jets at some point anyway. So yeah, I'll upgrade my jets. Why the hell is not? Anyways, um, uh, you've seen most of this before, so I'm going to pause and then uh, when we get to a significant point in it, we carry on, just like I promised before. So, I'll see you in the next second book here. For you, that is. Finally, we've arrived at the point, and yes, it was very tough getting there, because I'm um, uh, purely because... Uh, they throw, on the second run, they throw a heck of a lot more at you, the enemies are stronger, they take a bit more of your health and that, uh, and it's, generally it's just a lot harder to get in there, either that or I'm just sucking worse, but, make your own mind about that, I'm pretty sure you have anyway. Um, I'm now going to go back to the place I went before, before I had the battle with Atlas, I went over here and I found someone. Right, find someone now here, you just find a lonely heart. Oh, what a lonely heart that I can So, yes, we're now fighting this guy again. I could end up losing the amount of 
help I got left, but well, we'll see what happens. <laughs> so we meet again, Astro. I've been waiting for you, Astro. Let's see which one of us is the strongest robot alive. I don't know what you're thinking, Atlas. Hmm. So you do know. Interesting. Let's see how much you've evolved. Here we go! Come at me, Astro! Fight! And we say before, just make sure you get out of his way. Oi, what the hell are you jets on you again? Oh, I'm probably gonna die in a minute. Anyway, so once he pauses at this point, you have know, to clear out the way! Oh dear, never mind. Well, uh, I'm wondering why I'm not cutting this out, you know, but uh, don't worry, I hope this won't become a film montage because I've taken it on before I sh and I ain't mean nothing then. Oh my god, already? Yikes, Daisy! Oh dear, Atlas, you are more fun to- Ow, how the hell did he hit me? You've more fun than ever now. Yikes. Anyways, time to beat more laser beach. And let's continue the conversation! Enough, Atlas! I have a very important mission I have to accomplish! I fight for a future of peace between humanity and robots! Yay! I don't have time to waste them here, oh jeez. <laughs> you imagine the dream world, one that will never exist. First of all, that's not what you were built for. Do you want to know what your true purpose is in life was for Astro? You were created as a replacement for Dr. Tender's late son, Tobio. You're just a fake, created to help him forget his loss. But he couldn't truly love a robot as a replacement for his son. So he abandoned you. You're just like me, neither a truly human nor truly robot. Created to help relieve a man's anguish, but tossed away, unwanted. I don't believe you. I'm gonna stop you the crap out of you, anyways. Hold on a second. Ah, oh, sorry about that. Um, it's what you need to have got to do, but now you have to keep out of his big phallic thing, and he's jetting around the place like a moon. Oh, well, I still have my lasers. I think he still has his as well, but. Now to keep out of the way and uh, laser him. Oh, oops, what all about that? Go on, Atlas, give it up. Seriously. Anyways, we beat him again, and this time we find something strange on all that debris that we saw last time. Hey, there's a Oh, it's head now, I'm See that? The head? See, it's going up right now. It's... Where's it gone? Oh, it's coming back down there. See, there. It's just coming across our first. Yes, I think you may have recognised it earlier in the cutscene a couple of videos ago. Is... is this... an artificial hibernation capsule? Alice, you know this woman, don't you? And, yeah, the most of the things seen it all before and he's screaming and going out of my head and I'm off. But, slightly different bit here. What a shame. You must evolve and love to become stronger, Astro. Are you Dr. Tenma? That's right. What's it to you? So, you must be my father? What kind of robot is a father, you idiot? What? <laughs> and when did I promise to say what every single goddamn time? Anyway. <coughs> so, is what I just told me the truth then? Did you really abandon me? <laughs> so what if I did? You expect me to get down my knees and ask for forgiveness? No, you're an asshole. Listen to me, Astro. You created to overcome the limitations of useless human feelings. Don't let your emotions get in the way. Learn to control and evolve. You have that power. Wait, Doctor! And, well, since you beat up Atlas a number of times and thoroughly understand who he is, he's included in our mega factor as well. And, um, 
Well, we'll put it the next thing. We're Russian roulette as to um, what power are we going to upgrade next time before we go to the next stage. And uh, we'll do that next video.